Powersource.com here for a load and noise test of the Westinghouse iGen 4500 dual fuel. First, we're going to run it under eco mode with no load. We'll test the decibel readings at the unit 20 feet, 30 feet, and 50 feet. Then we'll come back and apply a load, which is a 1500 watt heat gun. It's the same load that we've applied to all the generators that we reviewed. So you have a baseline. You can make a comparison between this generator and all the other generators that we reviewed. And then we will retest a voltage drop and an amp reading as well as a decibel reading with the load at the unit 20 feet 30 feet and 50 feet so without further ado we'll go ahead and crank this up nothing is running as you can see we'll go ahead and click over to eco mode you can hear that throttle down and we'll turn on the decibel meter first i will get an ambient reading for you so you know what the ambient noise is before we test this. About 48 to 50 decibels ambient. We're getting a little bit of a breeze here. So we'll go ahead and turn this back on. Outputting 124 volts, which jives with what we're seeing on the front LED here. 124, 124 on the meter. about 80 decibels at the unit and we'll go to 20 feet 61 and a half to 62 decibels at 20 feet we'll go to 30 58 59 decibels at 30 feet we'll go to 50 feet 55 decibels at 50 feet now we're going to go ahead and apply the load again a 1500 watt heat gun all right now we're going to go ahead and engage the on on high mode and we will watch the voltage drop first before we get a decibel reading so watch the voltage drop as we engage the heat gun down to about 100 volts and then back up to 120 and we are putting out 13 amps right now so we'll turn that off and we'll do that again here you can watch the amp as well as the voltage meter when I engage this three two one Now we'll get a decibel reading. 84, 85 decibels at the unit. We'll go to 20 feet. 68 and a half decibels at 20 feet. We'll go to 30. 66, 67 decibels at 30 feet. Now we'll go to 50 feet. Between 57 and 58 decibels at 50 feet under load with a 1500 watt heat gun for the Westinghouse iGen 4500. Thanks for watching guys. Next we're going to test this on a travel trailer where we test the AC which is a 13,500 BTU AC, the electric fireplace, the electric hot water heater, etc. So we'll do that next. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. It's what helps us to keep going. We'll be back next time for more video reviews.